Hey, what's going on, everybody? It is your boy Hubble here today, and it is finally time for the biggest game of the entire year. It is now time for Super Bowl 53, and it is coming up this Sunday, February 3rd, 6.30 p.m. Eastern Time on CBS. We have the number two seeded 11-5 New England Patriots versus the number two seeded 13-3 LA Rams. And it is going to be a wonderful game between a dynasty and a young upstart team. So to me, the biggest keys in this game are going to be if the Rams can generate pass rush, get to Tom Brady, disrupt him like the Eagles and the Giants have done before, and if the Patriots can continue to be great and just bury this Rams team and, and prove that really the, uh, the Saints should have been there over them. But uh, I'm going to keep this video uh, short and sweet and concise because um, I had a 20 minute video filmed and my audio didn't record so now I'm, I'm slightly angered and I just want to uh, get this video out to you guys so it's a uh, <clears throat> it's gonna be interesting because if Todd Gurley's ready to go he's gonna be obviously a game changer but outside of Gurley, Goff and uh, Brandon Cooks I don't really know who this team has that can be a threat on offense and their defense obviously has given up a lot of big plays through the back end Peters and Tlaib not exactly the best corners this season they've been okay but they haven't been great and the pass rush is going to have to get to Tom Brady like I mentioned that's the number one way to beat the Patriots and it's put pressure right in the face of Tom Brady and the Patriots their keys to victory is just um, to get the ball to Julian Edelman get the ball to Rob Gronkowski and uh, don't let Brady get hit don't let him get pressured and don't let him get sacked that's that's really about it those are the the keys to this game obviously the Rams are a much different team now than they were at the beginning of the year and the Patriots they're pretty much always the same team that they are when they start the year but uh, Belichick's gonna be looking at all the game tape he's gonna be trying to figure out where the weaknesses are what Jared Goff likes to do what he doesn't like to do what coverages he struggles against what packages he struggles against what blitzes he struggles against and uh, it's gonna be a really big thing for Sean McVay to try to figure out uh, how to exploit this Patriots defense and and what they can do really to get their guys open who are less than than great and uh, obviously speaking of playmakers for the Rams let's talk about Brandon Cooks who the last time he played in a Super Bowl was last year for the Patriots and he got knocked out absolutely obliterated by Malcolm Jenkins so here's hoping he doesn't get destroyed this year let's hope that he does some destroying because my pick for this Super Bowl is going to be the Los Angeles Rams my head says the Patriots my heart says the Rams and I, I really do have a lot of doubt with the LA Rams I have a lot of doubt especially after the NFC Championship and obviously with the Patriots they're they normally leave you with no doubt so this is going to be a very interesting game this Sunday. Obviously, it is the end-all, be-all. So after this, there is no more NFL football. So let's just pray for a good game. Let's hope to God that uh, Belichick and Brady don't cheat for a sixth because nobody in the world wants to see that unless you're from Boston or you like to ride bandwagons. So I think everybody in America is pretty much rooting for the LA Rams. So let's do this, Rams. Let's win the Super Bowl. Let's shut these goddamn Patriots fans up once and for all and uh, send their dynasty to where my ex-girlfriend lives, and that is in the bottomless pit of hell. So thank you guys for watching. I have picked the LA Rams to win the Super Bowl, and um, make sure to leave a like on this video. Hit that subscribe button. Drop a comment. Get engaged with each other. Let's see what you guys think about the Super Bowl. I'll be responding to everyone who comments, unless it's something completely stupid. So that's going to do it for me, your boy Hubble. Hope that you guys enjoyed. I uh, hope that you guys enjoy the game this Sunday. Please make sure to stay safe, eat some great food, hang out with your family, your friends. Don't drink and drive because that's only for stupid people. And uh, just, just make sure to stay safe and have fun this weekend. Obviously, I know a lot of people are going to be taking Monday off work, myself included. Because after a Super Bowl, you just don't want to do anything the next day. And if the Patriots win, I would be really pissed off all day long. So let's pray the Rams win so I'm not really pissed off all day long. So let's go do it for me, guys. Hope that you enjoyed again. And um, I will catch you guys at some point down the line with another video. Hopefully it doesn't take until September 
to start rolling out more videos. I'm gonna try to 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 bring out some more stuff for you guys. So uh, yeah, that's gonna do it. I've picked the Rams to win the Super Bowl, like I said, <laughs> like twice now earlier. So that's gonna do it for this video. Hope that you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.